Hey, welcome back to the channel. Here are five reasons why this is the best phone holder or phone mount you can get for this car or perhaps even any car. It's by a brand called Unbreak Cable. Not the fanciest of names, but I tell you what, this thing is a masterpiece for what it's supposed to do. Reason number one, it is so easy to operate with just one hand. Just like that, your phone is in, it's not moving anywhere, you can take this thing rock crawling. To make it release your phone so you can pull it out, there are two little buttons on the side, you just press them, and it releases just like that. Reason number two, you can use this with absolutely any phone. It doesn't matter what sort of case you have. You don't need a proprietary case or attachment. If you have multiple phones, you know, one for work, one for personal use, one for your side chick, one for your side dude, you can use all those different phones in this phone holder. Reason number three is the way it mounts. It's got this kind of base plate where you can bend the upper and lower tabs in to conform to the curvature of this dash panel. Every other phone mount, it's not gonna attach to a curved dashboard like this. So you're gonna to have to find some sort of flat spot, which really limits your options as to where you can mount this. Because I don't like using the aircon vents to mount phone holders, because then you're not able to move your aircon vents around. And also, when you're going over bumpy roads, the vibration is gonna make the aircon vent kind of point downwards, hence your phone as well is gonna gradually kind of point downwards. I don't like fixing anything to the top of the dash, because the vinyl that's used on the top of the dash, it's got this kind of uh, texture to it. So when the sun beats down on the double-sided adhesive, it's gonna kind of go through these softening and hardening cycles. The adhesive is really gonna sink into those grooves. So when it comes time to wanna remove that, it's gonna leave behind some really tough to remove marks. And with one of these things, when it comes time to remove it, just use a little bit of heat from say a hairdryer, and a plastic pry tool, and this will come off really clean. Maybe use a bit of isopropyl alcohol to give it a final wipe down, and you're gonna have no markings left behind, especially with this surface, because it's a nice, smooth, glossy surface. And the other option you have is to affix it directly to the front windshield. Depending on where you live, that could be illegal and could get you in a bit of trouble. The reason number four, which is where you can mount it. This is the best position to mount a phone in almost any car, because you can have your eyes pointed straight down the road right to the middle of the windscreen and you can still see your phone at a quick glance also if you do happen to look directly at your phone you're not going to lose peripheral vision of what's outside and in front of you at the same time you're able to mount it right here on the front dash panel without it getting in the way of your audio controls in this case my roof controls or the air conditioning controls it's right where it should be and still within a quick reach from where your hands would normally be. Reason number five is just how securely this holds your phone compared to, let's say, like a magnetic style one. I've used a magnet style one before and they work all right, but if you ask me, would I use one of those things when I'm riding my motorcycle? Absolutely not. They just don't feel as secure as having something physically grabbing your phone like, like this thing does. It's got three contact surfaces and even the lower one, it's... Uh, kind of curved upwards so your phone isn't gonna slide out from underneath. You can drive this over potholes, you can go rock climbing with this thing and your phone is not going anywhere. So there you go, five reasons why I think this is the best phone holder on the market for this car or perhaps even any car. You can get this on Amazon, I've put a link in the description below and if you use that link, it will support me and support this channel, but it'll make no difference to you whatsoever. So um, if you do use the link, I'd really appreciate it. Thank you so much for watching and uh, happy driving. Are you serious, Tony?